Hi, my name is Gabe Reeve, and this is my colleague Eric Rubness, and this is Sports Center. Let's start out with softball. The Hornets had three games last week. The first game was against Gibson City, a conference game that looked like Gibson City had this game won, but the Hornets walked it off in the bottom of the seventh, winning 5-4. to four. They played Moreau the next day. The Hornets scored three in the top of the seventh, making the game go into extra innings. Both scored one in the ninth, and the Hornets scored four in the, in the tenth in, inning, winning 9-5. to five. The Hornets had another conference game against DMAC. The Hornets started out strong, scoring six runs in the first. Now let's play. They played great throughout the game and won 13 to two. Now let's go in the closet with Connor Williams. Welcome back to In the Closet. I'm Connor Williams. I'm here with Peyton Marr. And we're going to we're going to be talking about the up and coming track season. Uh, so we're going to start with the first question. How do you think your season is going to go this year from how it went last year? Um, I think we'll do all right. We have a lot of great freshmen coming in, so I feel like our relays are going to be pretty strong this year. And what's the team's goal for this year? State. What's something that, you, that you're looking forward to this year and why? Uh, state. We're looking forward to state because it's fun and we have fun every year. So what are some challenges that you had last year that you're, gonna pl that you're planning to fix this year? Um, we kind of struggled on the relay side, like I said, but since we had some freshmen come in and we have some good um, fast juniors, we'll be all right this year. How would you like here with students to, to support you this year? Uh, try to get as many to come out as we can for home meets and just let them know when they're there. So how have you improved over the many years of track? Uh, I'd like to say I got faster. I don't know. I don't really. I got faster. Yeah. How do you do? You plan to have a future in track? No. <laughs> okay. So, what will you miss most about playing high school track? Um, probably the like meeting of friends. You meet a lot of new people at track meets, so you'll probably miss meet, making friends like that. So, what's your favorite moment of your high school track career so far? Mm, going to state my freshman and sophomore year. How do you plan to top that this year? Go back to state since we didn't go last year. <laughs> Thank you. I'm Connor Williams <laughs> with Peyton Marr. Back to you. Thank you, Connor, for that great interview. The Hornets had two games last week. They had a home conference game against Gibson City. The Hornets started out strong, but Gibson City started coming back. The game ended in a seven. Wow, in a tie at 17 and 8 innings. Did you see that? Yeah, it's crazy. Wow, what a game. You were there. I know. <laughs> <laughs> we played another college game at DMAC. That's, that's, DMAC scored three runs in the first, but the Hornets tied them in the top of the second inning. DMAC kept playing well and won, 7 to 4. Now we're going into track. So the track meet on April 25th for the guys in the 100 meter, Tobias Brown placed fourth in the 200 meter, Devin Butler placed third in the 100 meter. In the 110 meter hurdles, Cody Durflinger placed third, and in the 300 meter hurdles, Devin Butler and Cody Durflinger placed first and second. In the long jump, Devin Butler placed third. In the ladies, Morgan Hancock placed third in the 100 meter. In the 200 meter, Haley Gibson placed first, and in, and Shay Rupert placed second. And Ashley Spencer placed fourth in the 400 meter. Shay Rupert placed second in the 800 meter. Anna Holland placed third in the 600 meter, 1600 meter. Anna Holland placed third in the 3200 meter. Lucy Bianco placed first in discus. Stephanie Brown placed fourth. You good? That's a mouthful. Hey, you ready for this? The track meet on April 28th for the guys. Devin Butler placed fourth in the 200 meter and third in the 400 meter and fourth for long jump. For the girls, Anna Holland placed third in the 3200 meter and uh, Allison Jason placed fourth in discus. Well done, you guys. Ladies and gentlemen and students of Hayworth, this is Sports Center.